Here's $300, here's $200, here's $6,000. That's a lot of money. What kind of medical debt are you looking at? I'm probably over a million dollars in medical debt now. A million dollars? The whole foot was reversed, like the front of the tennis shoe was back here. Oh my God. Today, over 52 million American adults are living without medical insurance. I always thought that living here, I'd be able to get all the healthcare I wanted, but it's gotten so expensive that a lot of people can't afford it. How did we get here? We got here because we allowed Wall Street to take over our healthcare system. In 2009, seven million Americans postponed major surgery due to the high cost of care. The pain gets so bad, it felt like somebody sticking a knife in it sometimes. Forcing Americans to look elsewhere in the world for help. Why are we now on a train to Mexico? In this episode of Vanguard, we follow American patients who are leaving the comforts of home and their homeland. In the States, I would probably lose my house. So you can walk or you can lose your house. And head to places far and wide in order to get the treatment that they cannot afford in the U.S. This might be the future of healthcare in America. It's just sad that I had to leave America to get good treatment.